The curiosity about our future is something we all share. We long to know what lies ahead. And thankfully, God has a wonderful plan for each one of us. However, to experience and understand this plan fully, we must be willing to listen and pay attention to the signs and the messages he sends our way. As you tune into this message, take a moment to sense the presence of God surrounding you. He is not distant or unreachable. He is right here beside you, delivering these words directly to your heart. And he's speaking something very important to you regarding your future. God is saying, My child, I am sorry, but you are banned. These words may sound stern, but they come from a heart overflowing with love. You see, life is like a journey, and sometimes we take wrong turns or stray from the path I have set for you. But even in those moments, my love for you never wavers. I want you to know that you are never alone. I walk beside you every step of the way, guiding you, protecting you, and gently nudging you back on the track when you lose your way. But here is the thing. Your future isn't set in stone. You have the power to shape it with your choices, your actions, and your faith. So when I say you are bad, I'm inviting you to pause, reflect, and reconsider the direction you are heading in. I want what is best for you, my dear ones. I want you to experience joy, peace, and fulfillment beyond measure. And sometimes, that means taking a step back, re-evaluating your choices, and realigning your path with my divine plan for you. My dear child, in the depths of your heart, there may be worries that weigh heavily on your soul, anxieties that keep you awake at night, and burdens that seem too heavy to bear. Yet, I am here to tell you that you need not carry them alone. I, your Heavenly Father, am here to offer you solace, peace, and comfort. Imagine yourself laying down the weight of those burdens, one by one, at my feet. Feel the relief as you release each worry, each fear, each uncertainty into my loving care. Picture yourself breathing deeply, feeling a sense of lightness and freedom wash over you as you surrender your troubles to me. For I am the God who cares deeply for you, who knows the number of hair on your head, who sees every tear that falls from your eyes. I am intimately acquainted with all your ways, and I long to bring you the peace that surpasses all understanding. So my precious child, let go of those worries that haunt your mind, those anxieties that keep you awake at night, and trust them to me, knowing that I am able to handle them far better than you could ever. Allow yourself to rest in the knowledge that I am watching over you, guarding you, and guiding you every step of the way. Know that you are not alone in your struggles, for I am with you always, 
even to the end of the age. I am the God who never sleeps nor slumbers, the God who constantly watching over you, protecting you and providing for your every need. You are my beloved child, chosen and cherished beyond measure. Your worth is not determined by your accomplishments or successes, but by the fact that you are fearfully and wonderfully made in my image. You are my masterpiece, created for a purpose far greater than you can imagine. Trust in me, my child, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge me, and I will direct your paths. For I have the plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you a hope and a future. So, when the worries of this world threaten to overwhelm you, remember that you are not alone. I am here, ready and willing to bear your burdens, to lighten your load and to lead you into the abundant life that I have prepared for you. Rest in my love, my child, and let the peace of my presence wash over you like a gentle wave. For in me, you will find rest for your soul, strength for your journey, and hope for your future. With all my love, your Heavenly Father. Now type, God is good. If you believe that whatever is happening in your life is only leading you to your best destination under the supervision of God. Child of God, have you ever felt a gentle nudge inside, whispering, you have got this, when facing a tough challenge? Or have you ever heard that same voice urging, who says, there is more waiting for you, go for it. When considering a big opportunity, maybe you have even sensed it saying, don't hold back in fear. When an unexpected door opens before you, it is no surprise when God calls us to tasks that seem beyond our abilities. He wants us to stretch beyond what we think we can do and tap into His strength. But too often, we hesitate because staying in our comfort zone feels safer. Instead, we need to stand firm and trust that God gives us the confidence we need. Here is the good news for all of us. God assures us, my grace is enough for you. For my strength is made perfect in weakness. In other words, whatever challenge you face, God's strength is more than sufficient. He is telling us, I have got you covered for today. Focus on now, tomorrow will take care of itself. Yet, we often worry about tomorrow's problems, allowing doubt to creep in. We start questioning ourselves, thinking, Maybe I'm not good enough. What was I thinking? But God has already equipped us for the tasks ahead. He has placed abilities within us that we haven't even discovered yet. So when fear and doubt arise, we must remind ourselves, God, it's you and me. When I'm weak, you are strong. With your strength, nothing can defeat me. You will provide all I need today. The ideas, the strength, the courage, 
and together we can do this. Psalm 91 says, Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. Surely He will save you from the false snare and from the deadly pestilence. He will cover you with His feathers and under His wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness will be your shield and rampart. So take a bold step of faith, embrace the challenges before you with confidence knowing that God's strength will see you through. Now dear child of God, don't hesitate and pray this with all your faith. Say this, Heavenly Father, as we gather here before you today, we come with hearts full of gratitude for your love, guidance and protection in our lives. You are our refuge and strength, our ever-present help in times of trouble. We thank you for the reassurance we find in your word, especially in passages like Psalm 91 which reminds us of your constant care and supervision. Lord, we lift up to you the concerns and worries that we have on our hearts. We acknowledge that there are times when we feel overwhelmed by the challenges we face, when doubts and fears threaten to consume us. But in those moments, help us to remember your promises, to trust in your unfailing love and to find strength in your presence. You have called us to step out in faith to embrace the opportunities and the challenges that come our way. Yet, too often, we hesitate, allowing fear to hold us back from experiencing the fullness of life you have planned for us. So Lord, give us the courage to step out of our comfort zones, knowing that you are with us every step of the way. Lord, we pray for those who are struggling to find their purpose, who feel lost and alone in the midst of life's uncertainties. Show them that they are not forgotten, that you have a plan and a purpose for their lives. Help them to trust in your timing, to lean on your strength, and to walk boldly in the path you have set before them. We also lift up to you those who are facing difficult circumstances, Lord, whether it be illness, financial hardships, or broken relationships. We ask for your healing touch, your provision, and your peace to be upon them. May they feel your presence surrounding them, comforting them, and giving them hope for the future. Lord, in a world filled with distractions and uncertainties, Help us to keep our eyes fixed on you. Teach us to seek first your kingdom and your righteousness, knowing that when we do, all these things will be added unto us. Give us the wisdom to discern your will, Lord, the strength to follow where you lead, and the faith to trust in your goodness and grace. As we go forth from this time of prayer, May we carry with us the assurance of your love, the confidence of your promises, and the peace that surpasses all understanding. May our lives be a reflection of your light and love, shining brightly in a world that so desperately needs to know you. In Jesus' name we pray, Amen. Now to all the listeners and the followers of God, if you want to be a part of our happy Christian's family, do subscribe to this channel and don't forget to share this video with your loved ones. God bless you.